They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. What should we do first, Kenny? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing, and blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Janie just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast and let's be careful. I just wanted them to know that I trust Jane. And I also wanted to go with Jane so she wouldn't attempt to kill or kill or rob that boy that, uh, that I've seen. So it's much easier to go with her and not and for her not to rob the boy than for me to just go with somebody else. It just makes more sense. I can't remember what the boy did for me or what he was going to do for me, but I do remember the boy. And you either have the option to rob him or oh, hey. give him a shit. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. It's just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Partner? Don't let it get to your head. Let's go. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Check this out. A skate still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? Do you think you can pick the lock? I should be able to figure something out. Maybe this will work. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. Okay. I hate how slow she walks. There's no point in even looking at that because
There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Why is he coming up here? No idea. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Подожди, подожди. I just want to talk to you. Do you understand me? Yes. I'm on the trigger. On the trigger. Like a new. I don't want to shoot anyone, especially Malinka Devochka, uh, little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I sp Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. This medicine is all she has. Is it just you and your sister? No, I have many friends in the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you you take my sister's medicine. You are worried. Hey, we've got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need People that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you must believe... We don't believe, believe a fucking word about your sick... You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Portia. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. I mean, we could have took some of it. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place open. Then we need to get moved in ASAP.
Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation deck? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from you in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop, and a stranger showed up. What? Shit. This is the last thing we need right now. What happened? Jane took his gun and scared him off. Well, I, uh, glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah, she's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep, that's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Are you any better? Is anyone? Whoa, whoa, hold on. I, I didn't mean... I just want to survive. And that means picking the right sides. In the army, battle buddies are all you need. I need to you trust your battle buddy? The deck. Yeah, good. I you will, can trust uh, anybody. You, you can trust anybody that's your battle buddy. That's the mentality, anyway. Never leave a soldier behind. If we die, we die together. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you, you're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I hope you're right. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? You're going to be a good mom. We sure have come a long way since we first met, huh? You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ah, oh shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on him. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. In my opinion, we should have separated them, Mike and Bonnie, and put uh, maybe Luke, Luke or somebody, somebody other than them two together. But it's kind of hard because it's like, there's three of them, and Sarah's fucking out of it. We have a pregnant woman. Kenny has to stay with the pregnant woman. I'm just like, I'm like intermediate. I gotta, I gotta be certain places at certain times, and I, you know, I gotta keep up with shit. And Luke is kind of just a cripple with a weapon. <laughs> He's just a cripple with a gun. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? Well, it's just a, a feeling. I know Jane seems like she doesn't care about anyone, but I trust her.